Thank you mm. for having a sip of my tea here. Hey. Now, this year yeah. marks 25 years <laughs> since We're on six. We are. <laughs> relatively unknown actors first appeared on our TV screen. Morning, Ross. Who's here that on this couch. <laughs> there she is. Whoa. On a oh. friend. Hey, oh. We were on a break. Oh, Get out of reach. <laughs> It's comfy. It is. It is the couch from oh, friends. They helped each like other out through their lives and through early adulthood, and we love them. Yeah, well, this is like the, the favourite meeting spot, right? Yeah. You know, the Central Perk this coffee shop, yeah, and there's yeah, a chance that it. Ross and Rachel yeah. may have been sipping out of this very cup. I think Phoebe just sang over there when she brought a guitar along. Oh, that's right. Yeah, she yeah, was yeah. a great yeah, singer, yeah. wasn't she, Phoebe? I realised <laughs> I've got a hole in my shoe. <laughs> oh, <laughs> yeah. Look, Friends went to air uh, over 10 seasons, over 10 years, was nominated. Guess how many Emmy Awards it was nominated? 60. 62. Very close. Oh. Very brief. Sorry, Ross. Um, and those, uh, those six <laughs> unknown actors became globally recognised stars. And to celebrate this incredible milestone, of course, it aired here on Channel 9. We loved it. It still we, is. Yeah, well, of course it is, yeah. Uh, we caught up... <laughs> <laughs> Stupid, why would you go anywhere else? We caught up with, uh, with one of the cast members. <laughs> It was September 1994 when we first met Rachel. It's like all of my life, everyone has always told me, you're a shoe. And then today I just stopped and I said, what if I don't want to be a shoe? Phoebe. Oh, I just pulled out four eyelashes. That can't be good. Monica. Hey, I can be a kook. <laughs> Ross. It's morphin' time. Chandler. Hey, Ross, look what I got going here. And Joey. It's a known fact that women love babies, all right? Women love guys who love babies. As the six friends navigated their 20s and 30s, millions of viewers around the world tuned in and could relate. There were the breakups. I'll be fine, all right? Really, everyone, I hope she'll be very happy. No, you don't. No, I don't. To hell with her, she left me. We were on a break! <laughs> the makeups. I love her. I love her. <laughs> I love you too, and I am never letting you go again. Career journeys. Oh, come on, you can't live off your parents your whole life. I know that. That's why I was getting married. Got there? I can't pay for this right now because uh, I'm not working, so I've had to cut down on some luxuries like uh, paying for stuff. Hi, Monica. <laughs> How's it going? Nice boots. Oops, you're never going to believe it. This headhunter called me. I have a meeting tomorrow with Gucci. Gucci wants me. I'm up for tenure. Congratulations. You too. The famous friends spent most days catching up on each other's lives at the local coffee shop. And for one cast member, his day job led him straight to the now iconic Central Perk. Don't wink at me. <laughs> I was a barista when they called me to come in and do it. And they literally, the second he called me to be coffee guy, pre-Gunther, because he knew that I had experience as a barista. James Michael Tyler played coffee shop worker Gunther for 10 years. When I'm in a cafe having coffee, or I see a man with hair brighter than the sun, <laughs> I'll think of you. A friend of mine who was practicing to be a hairstylist, and I allowed him to bleach my hair, no intention of keeping it for 10 years, but when I showed up on the set and they kept asking me back week after week, the creators of the show said, we like that look, we'd like him to keep it. So I learned how to bleach my own hair. He says there's a reason the show continues to be so successful so many years later. Everyone I know can relate to that time right after your 20s when you've left your family, you might be in school, and that's when your group of friends become your family. And uh, you, you have the same struggles. Uh, the same needs, the same wants, the same trying to find love, marriage. Uh, everyone can relate to that. That's a timeless theme. But as for a reunion... I don't think it really needs one, my own personal opinion. Uh, I mean, seeing people who are now, you know, 25 years older going through the same struggles that they went, then that would be kind of a tragedy in either comedy, I, I'm afraid. Luckily for us, 25 years later, Every episode is still just as enjoyable as it was on that first day back in 1994. So it's kind of strange to think that it's been that long because it, 
it, it seems like yesterday to me in a lot of ways. Oh, what a show. Isn't that terrific? Yeah, the very final episode, the final, final episode aired in 2004 and in the States. It was what? Guess how many people watched it in the 50 States? 50 million. Very close, Ford. Oh, gee, you're good at this stuff. Uh, 52 million viewers, wow. making it Uncanny. the most watched television uh, episode of the year, or of the 2000s, in fact, yeah. and the fifth most watched finale in television history. I think MASH is still number one. Amazing. Yeah. Well and yeah. You know, you speak to any hairdresser around that, er, around that <laughs> era, yeah. and everyone used to come in saying, I want the Jennifer Aniston hair. Yeah. Yeah. I want Rachel's I want hair. The Rachel. yeah. Yeah. Everyone. I it went was, for Jennifer. It, uh, yeah. it, it was huge. <laughs> How good was Joey was my favourite, Joey. Yeah. And what was uh, the spin-off Joey did? Joey. It was called Joey. It was called Joey. Joey. Yeah. That'd be right. Well, that was a Joey moment. <laughs> <Yeah>. And <laughs> as, as Dickie touched on earlier, 25 years later, Friends is still watched, isn't it? Right around, still the, world. around the world. And um, of course, we play episodes right here on the Nine Network, don't we, Dickie? And yes, we on do. our well, Nine, Nine Go, Go channel. channel. Yeah. And, and Stan, and, and of course. Stan. That's exactly yeah. right. Stan. Yeah. Guess yeah. Yeah. How, many episodes, of... how many episodes do you reckon there were? 260. How many? 260. Very close, Fordo. 263. <laughs> it's like you're cheating. Wow, it's it's very, very just very uncanny close. photo. It, it is. Yeah. And so to celebrate 25 years of the sitcom, Stan is taking this couch, the Central Perk couch, on tour. Our couch. Oh, the wow. couch Whoa. all around Australia. It's the Friends 25 on Stan couch tour officially and it starts today. So we're the official ones to kick it off. Gosh. And you can see on your screen where it will be, where you'll also... Uh, get a chance to sit down and be comfortable with Central Perk. We'll put all the details on our website as well. But how yep. about that? Ooh. You can get a chance to do it you too. You can practically still smell them on here, can't well, you? <laughs> well, hopefully it's been dry. Are we going to clean it up before we send it out? Either? No, no it's 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 a good good good. Good. Yeah. Yeah. little marks. You know, this is the second time I've sat on this couch. I went actually I went over tell. to LA and went into the, <laughs> yeah. went into the studio and, and actually went into the studio where they made friends and sat on this couch. So is this the couch? This is the Does couch. Does it look familiar? Yeah, wow. this is the one. Gee, she's aged well, hasn't she? Yeah, I know. If you look down the back here, there's... What can you find? Oh, the twenty down there somewhere. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Or a dime, maybe. A dime. Yeah. yeah. Dime. There you go. Well, what a cool. thrill. What a buzz. A round of applause for friends, out. everybody. Yeah. Yeah. We should. Yeah. Oh, no, no, we should do this. We love your friends. <laughs> this sort of a... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay, one, two, <laughs> one, two, oh, one, two, three, four. We got it. Oh, oh did we? Yeah. See it all on stand. <laughs>